Hi everyone, so here's the image I'll be using for the uh, painting. Uh, I'll be painting on a panel uh, 12 by 10 inches and I've divided the panel into 2 inch squares. Now you can see this um, here. Yeah, okay, so here's the grid um, with the drawing uh, mapped on. I'll put this on my blog, John Geeky Art. So if you just Google John Geeky Art, you'll see this and can download it. And here I just painted the background black. Uh, very quickly put the headscarf and the um, rest of some details on. And that gives me this ready to start the video. So here we go. Get ready. One, two, three. Beep beep. Okay, everybody. Um, hi. I'm going to uh, try and do a little video for a group I help out over at Hauntsey in East Yorkshire. It's the um, oh, by the way, that was uh, that was George down there. Um, just had a walk. Right. So I'm preparing a studio arrangement here to try and get an idea of portraiture and specifically to paint. Vermeer's uh, girl with the pearl earring. So, without further ado, I'll uh, just take you through it. Okay, so what I'll be doing, I'll be using this Country Life magazine picture, which seems to be quite a nice one. Um, although it does lack a bit of detail when you see the real picture. Uh, and so what I've done is I've produced a pencil outline and very roughly, the other night, I put this colour on. Um, OK, so... OK, so I'm using my old pochard box here. You see, the old pochard box paints are out here. But I'm using my old pochard box to mix the uh, paints on. So what I've got here... OK, and here's the palette, simple palette. Uh, cadmium light red, raw sienna, French ultramarine, and a large dollop of uh, titanium white. Later, I added a small amount of black.
Okay, everybody, well, I think I'm going to stop now. Uh, I've been on it for about an hour and a bit, hour and a half maybe. Um, there's George again, still resting. And uh, here's the picture. I could have done a lot more to it, but I'm going to leave it at that. Um, it was only meant to be a quick demonstration for my little group over at Hauntsey. So I hope you've enjoyed it. Uh, just a quick look at the palette. It's a bit of a mess, but uh, there you go. Why not give it a try? Use the template I've put on at the start of the video. Um, if you want a link to that, I'll put a link on. In fact, I will put a link on to my blog so you can download it and uh, use the grid. Right, happy painting. Okay, that's me uh, done. So hopefully I'll put some more work on later. But um, during this awful time of COVID, uh, we've all got to try and be as uh, creative and positive and keep our mental state as healthy as possible. So, okay, bye for now. Okay, everybody, don't forget, go to um, John Geeky Art. You'll see the grid and you can download it, print it off and have a go yourself on your own proportions but uh, it works quite well on a 10 by 12. Happy painting, bye for now.